now day 12 of the century drill. Now, first of all, I hope you all have not lost count of what day you're on, or missed a day, and had to start all over again. But, if you're on day 12 now, this is what we're doing today. Now, yesterday I taught you the four strike exercise. And it works like this, just to recap. Now, remember to look at the face of the Pell, so that you can train yourself to see with your peripheral vision. First, you hit to the right side of the head, hit down to the left leg, right leg, and left head. So it works like that. Today we're going to change up that pattern. Now, what this new version does is, like I said, changes up the, it switches up the pattern, but it also teaches you to be able to strike from high to low or low to high all on one side, basically to do this. Instead of that. What this does is it allows you to in some cases, catch your opponent off guard. So they may be thinking, you hit me in the leg, I've seen him do a lot of those, so he's probably going to do that. But instead, I hit him in the leg, I hit him in the head. He's thinking it's going to come from over here, but it comes from over here. Just one little trick you can do to your opponent. Alright. So, this new version works like this. Like that. So instead of going back and forth at the top, you go back and forth on the sides. So, let's go. Now, another thing that I want to caution you about is it can be a little difficult if this is the first time you're doing this exercise to keep count because naturally you want to go in that same rhythmic pattern from yesterday but now you gotta to learn to do this new pattern and you might lose count or mess up so just to warn you now again look at the face to use your peripheral vision here we go. Almost lost, lost count there. I can't remember where I hit. Right. And I switch hands. And that's the exercise for today. Now, tomorrow, to train, you notice that mostly I was going from leg to head. Tomorrow we're going to start with the legs, so it goes from head to legs instead. So, but that's uh, tomorrow's exercise, so for now, I'll say goodbye.